Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And late yesterday, June the 25th, there was a release of the uh, bug fixing updates, or what they call the cumulative update uh, preview updates that are available uh, for Windows 10, Windows 11 uh, operating systems. These are bug fixes. They are optional, well, optional until patch Tuesday when they ins install automatically. So for Windows 11 22H2 and 23H2, there was this uh, KB503-9302 that you can install. If you don't do anything, it won't install until Patch Tuesday. But if you do go and trigger Windows updates, you will see that in the Windows updates, check for updates, it will trigger. And you will actually see the update pop up. Uh, update is come out of update preview. For Windows 11, uh, in my case is 23H2, KB5039302, and this is, of course, the bug fixes. So what does it fix? fixes a few things about the operating system. Uh, one of them was the snipping tool that had problems with audio distortion when recording a video. Uh, there was a few things that are shuffling around the task manager and giving it better performance. Um, there's a few fixes for the, um, what was the other thing that I saw here that addresses a touch keyboard and uh, also one about ejecting USB devices uh, when using the safely remove hardware option. It would actually fail when you were using the task manager when it was open. One of the things you might see that I don't have, but I know that some of you might have it, is that they've changed the speed for DDR RAM. So if you go in your task manager, you know that in the performance tab, when you look at DDR memory, the speed of the memory is in megahertz. So this doesn't reflect the reality of speed. Um, somebody at 2,400 megahertz with certain RAM, DDR RAM, can actually go faster in transfer rate than some that are rated at 3000. So it gives you a false sense that I got 3000 megahertz, I'm faster than you, when in case, in, in many cases, it's not the case. It, it's really not a good measure of uh, the speed of transfer. So they've changed the megahertz to uh, millions of transfers per second. So for some of you, this will be the new number. And this reflects a lot better the reality of the speed of your memory uh, compared to another DDR RAM. Uh, so that, for some, will be there. It's not on my computer, but eventually it will show up. Once uh, you've installed it, of course, your Windows version for 22H2, 23H2 is 22.6.2.1 or 22.6.3.1 and the ending is 38.10. So uh, bug fixes, you don't have to apply them if you don't have any issues, but they will come with Patch Tuesday if you do not install today. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.